This segment of It's About You was sponsored by Ronald McDonald House Charities of Northeast Ohio. We have an exciting announcement that will make helping families with sick children easier and better throughout our area. Joe Cronauer went to the source for the big news. How do you make something that's already great even better? Well, you bring in the Ronald McDonald House to do just that. Craig Wilson has that answer for us. Craig, da 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 da, take it away. It's the big announcement. Uh, yes, I do have some very exciting news. Um, to better support the needs of family and children in Northeast Ohio, the four Ronald McDonald House entities that have been serving this area have decided to unite uh, together and become one entity. Um, we just felt it would be an opportunity for us to combine our talents and our resources to um, even better serve the families in Northeast Ohio. So we're really excited to announce it today that it has become official and that we are now the Ronald McDonald House Charities of Northeast Ohio. Well, congratulations to everyone and to you because you are now known as the Chief Executive Officer for Ronald McDonald House Charities of Northeast Ohio, like you said. It's quite a mouthful. I think you're going to need two cards to fit it all on there. <laughs> Tell me how this all came about, Craig. This is great news. Love to celebrate with you. Yeah, it's it, it's been a long process. Um, you know, we're fortunate that in our area, the Ronald McDonald House has been around a long time. So the Cleveland House has been uh, around 41 years, Akron 36 years. So we're a couple of the oldest Ronald McDonald Houses in, in the country. Ronald McDonald House Charities uh, globally has evolved since the beginning of this, uh, the formation of the houses. Um, so we are one of the few areas where the houses were separate from the charities chapters. Um, so we formed a task force that really studied this situation for 18 months, and it was made up of representatives of all the different entities. And in the end, this task force decided that it really did make sense for the four of us to combine to be, um, you know, more efficiently serve the, the families in Northeast Ohio. Um, and it also will allow the donations to come through the McDonald's restaurants to be a little bit more streamlined to come to one entity instead of four different entities. You know, let me let me t hit on that right now, Craig, because a lot of people have this misconception that mm -hmm. if they just go to McDonald's, that the Ronald McDonald houses are going to be taken care of. And that is definitely not the case. Uh, the way it was previously set up that um, the donations through McDonald's, um, a portion of those came to the two houses. In addition, there were uh, grants that were made throughout Northeast Ohio to different right. Um, so there was a combination of efforts through those donation boxes. Um, we'll be evaluating part of our process as, as the new entity to look at, you know, are we going to continue some of that granting or will, or will it go towards the core service programs? And you rely a lot, a lot on donations. All right. So, again, help me out here. Tell me about this whole area that this is all covering now. We're talking how many counties? So it's 23 counties. It um, starts from, you know, the Sandusky to the Ohio border over in Ashtabula, um, down through Akron, Canton, Mahoning Valley, and as far south as Mansfield. So it's a, a pretty big territory, 23 counties. Um, but we feel that we can do a better job as one entity to more efficiently serve those 23 counties. You know what? Look at the Avengers and what they did when they came together. This is a Marvel movie waiting to happen here, my friend. This well, we got to awesome. get our staff all those names. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so so let me ask you this, all right? Uh, a lot of times when mergers like these happen, uh, jobs are eliminated and programs are cut. That's yep. not going to happen, is it? No, that's not going to happen. All right. uh, you know, we run pretty lean and mean with our organization as far as staffing goes, and um, it's important that we maintain that staffing to provide all the services we currently provide. Uh, right. There may be some opportunities to add some staffing as we're enhancing programs down the road. Well, very good. All right. Can donors, volunteers, companies, they can come together right now and help the Ronald McDonald House Charities of Northeast Ohio. It's going to take me a little while to get that, my friend. <laughs> me too. <laughs> but, but tell us how we can help. Uh, there's a variety of ways. We, um, we will have a new website um, coming up, rmhcneo.org. Um, and there'll be you know, links to all kinds of opportunities for folks to donate or volunteer with the organization. Um, one thing to point out about donations that you, know, you can certainly designate uh, a specific house or specific program or territory that you want your donation to support. Um, obviously, we will honor all of those donor requests and we'll just have a variety of opportunities both locally and then on a regional basis for folks to support us. Well, you're definitely better positioned now more than ever to do just that. Congratulations. 
big news, and you heard it right here on It's About You, and today it is about Ronald McDonald House Charities of Northeast Ohio, and congratulations to the newly named CEO himself. Craig, thank you so much for being here. Craig Wilson, uh, we just love working with you, that's for sure. Uh, thank you. Thanks for your all you do for the house, too, and we really appreciate it.